Hello, Samis, and welcome to or back to my channel. It's your girl, Simply Wive, and today I bring you another episode of The Hyatts. Before we get into today's video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you never miss out when I post. Alright, Simmies, let's get into the video. Alright, y'all, so in the last video, y'all saw that Kalia gave birth to her and Omari's beautiful baby girl, Zyla. Even though she wound up going into labor early and, you know, everything was just thrown out of whack. We weren't expecting it. We still made sure that mama and baby were safe. So, I know y'all looking at the screen and wondering, like, where the heck they are. But if you guys remember from the last episode, I said that, you know, Kalia would kind of be going to this little recovery place. Just to have one day alone with Zyla because... You know, she's about to be back at home with, you know, having to chase Amir around and then they have a Lily too, y'all. So she just wanted some extra time to just really bond with her baby, you know, just, just her alone. So Omari's back at home with Amir and of course with Lily and Kalia's at this Airbnb with Zyla. So Omari did, you know, run out this Airbnb for them for just the night. So we're going to be spending the day here with Kalia and the baby and... Yes, as y'all can tell by the thumbnail, I did put her picture in there. Y'all should see Zyla's picture in there. So that's what baby girl is looking like. So freaking cute, so freaking adorable. And I just love her so much already. So I did go ahead and age her up to an infant just because, y'all, this season is about to end. And we don't have time to be playing around with the freaking stuck in the crib babies. Y'all already know the freaking newborns. You can't do nothing with them for real. So... I had to go ahead and age her up, but I still try to make her look like really babyish so she can like slowly grow into her features and grow into herself. But yeah, and of course I had to age her up so that way she could travel outside of the house. So yeah, we had to do that really quick. But before we get into the gameplay part, we're going to actually get into a little house tour. So let's go ahead and get into it, y'all. So... As y'all can see, we got this beautiful house. Oh, this is a build by Earth to Barb, y'all. This is the baby family home. So I will leave that in the description box for anybody that's interested. So when you walk in, this is the living room. I just love the cozy feel in here, y'all. Like, it's giving me just very much like cabin vibes. But it's not, you know, it's not a cabin. But I'll just step outside really quick just because we can go ahead and see the outside. But... I did put this in San Sequoia and I just love where this lot is placed like being able to come out into like the back porch and just stare out into the water it's just so beautiful like I just love that but yes outside we have a little patio area with a nice little fireplace and we might you know we might invite Sarai over maybe later on because it still is early it's not super early it's like 10 o'clock in the morning but um we might invite our best friend over maybe to meet the baby we'll see how we're feeling Kalia might just want to take today just to bond with her baby by herself you know so we might just leave it like that but yes we will not be touching any alcohol because Kalia is going to be pumping and it's just she just feels like it's too soon to be drinking you know she literally just gave birth not even 24 hours ago so yeah this is the kitchen so cute this is the dining area and it's some more parts downstairs that I want to get into. I just want to make sure I don't miss anything because this house was actually bigger and had more going on than I thought. So there is a little hallway space and there's two ways you can get back here. So you can come this way or the way I just came. And there is a bedroom downstairs and this looks like it is the master bedroom. Which is really nice. I love it. It's an easy one here. Y'all know Kalia does paint. Um... I love this freaking bathroom like the tub inside the shower is just lovely like please and then there's a huge closet with it looks like a little vanity area so that's really nice and as much as I would love Kalia to you know stay down here in this room 
um, the nursery is upstairs. So there is another bedroom upstairs, literally right beside the nursery. So that's where Kalia actually will be staying and we'll get up there in a moment. I just literally don't want to miss anything downstairs because it's literally so much downstairs I didn't know was here. But as y'all can see, we're coming from like the living room where the little bar area is. And there is another door here and this is a half bathroom. So, you know, she was to have guests over. But I really think we're just going to take the, the day just to bond with the baby. It makes the most sense. There is a laundry area, which is great because y'all know Zyla is a newborn. And, you know, things can just get a little bit messy. You know, pooping and, you know, babies can just get a little bit messy. So it's nice to have that laundry room there so that way we can easily wash things. But we come through the kitchen area. There is another door over here. And this is actually a full bathroom. So I do like that there is a full bathroom downstairs outside of the master bedroom. That's really nice. And as y'all saw, there were steps over here. So of course we're going to go upstairs because there is, you know, a little upstairs area. It's really nice up here as well. So when we come upstairs... The first door here is going to be a full bathroom. I freaking love it. And it has two sinks as well. Nice, huge shower. The tub is not inside, but we do get a tub as well. And then we're going to come around this corner. And I'm literally just trying to go in order of the doors. So this is the next door that we see. And this is like a entertainment room, it looks like. Like we have chests. We have a keyboard and it says our family is a circle of strength and love so obviously there's a beautiful family that lives in this house on the regular but they got it decorated really nice and they're smart to turn this into an airbnb because it's really nice but there's also a tv in here i don't think there was a tv downstairs so that's great and nice little artwork and we have three more doors that we're gonna go in i just want to make sure i'm not missing anything so yeah okay so we're going to this door next and this is actually where Kalia is going to be sleeping. So yeah, I like that, you know, it's kind of pink in here. It's really cute. She even has a little desk here, so if she wanted to get on the computer, she could. But this is where Kalia is going to be sleeping. Just something really simple. It's just one night that we're going to be here, so it's not that serious. And then what's the... I think that's the nursery. I'm going to say that. Yeah, I'm glad I, I did right. I did right. So there's another full bathroom in here. Just with a stand-up shower, no tub. But yeah, we have full range of the house. So whatever bathrooms we want to use, whatever we want to do is fine. And then, of course, the very last room here is going to be the nursery. So like I said, Kalia's room is literally going to be right here. And the nursery is literally right here. So she's not too far from Zyla. And I love that. So this is the nursery, y'all. The house was decorated already. So I did not do anything. As y'all can see, Kalia is still in her hospital gown. So we're definitely going to make sure she takes a nice hot bath and just, you know, get herself rid of the hospital. And we're going to come down and look at baby girl because she's actually um, soothing her to sleep right now. So look at my baby. Look at my baby girl, Zyla. Hold on, I'm trying to get a really good close-up of her. It's kind of hard with this angle, but look at her, y'all. Oh my God, let's just admire her for a couple seconds, okay? Y'all, she is so stinking cute. Like, oh, I love her. I love her. I love her. And she got her mama eye color. Like, I love that. And, yeah, we just got her this cute little onesie out of the hospital and this nice little head wrap. And y'all are going to see. Y'all probably see from the thumbnail. I don't know if I'm going to take photos of her in her onesie or take photos of her in the other outfit that I have for her. But y'all going to see um, her and Kalia kind of in matching outfits. And I freaking love that. So freaking adorable. But yes, baby girl is here, and I love her name, Zyla Renee. So y'all know I like to give my Sims middle names, even though I don't actually like, you know, I don't actually give them the middle name in cast, but, you know, my Sims have middle names. So Amir's middle name is actually Lee, so it's Amir Lee Hyatt, and then Zyla is Zyla Renee Hyatt, which, you know, I put Zyla Renee in the title of the video so y'all know that but yeah she's actually about to take her a little nap so now that we're out of time mode we can actually get into some gameplay so i'm gonna go ahead and let kalia you know let her go to sleep and let's 
because I had to turn my game sound down a little bit. So we're going to turn this back up. Yes. Okay. And Kalia, how are we feeling? She needs the pump. I know that for sure. Yes. Okay. So maybe we should have her pump before she... Yeah, we're going to have her pump before she actually takes a bath. Because I don't, you know, want her boobs to get too full and she literally needs to pump right like right now but as y'all can see Kalia you know she got some weight on her after having baby Zyla and that's okay because we're gonna take some time and slowly but surely she's gonna get back or try to get back down to the size that she was before Zyla but any extra weight that she keeps it doesn't even matter because it's so worth it because it's so worth it to have her baby girl and to have a mirror so i'm so excited for the next episode when they actually meet it's gonna be so freaking cute and i just can't wait to see it but um yeah we're gonna try to keep xyla on breast milk so even if it's out the bottle and you know kalia doesn't actually breastfeed her we're just gonna try to make sure that she strictly drinks breast milk we're gonna try to do that okay that's gonna be our goal that's gonna be something that we try to accomplish so I think she had a successful pumping session. Her stomach is hurting. Let's go over her moolahs really quick. So more babies. Girl, your sim wants another baby. Better get busy. Boo-hoo. Girl, Zyla is not even... You still have a new baby moolah for the next two days. No moment in a sim's life is more joyous than the birth of a child. And you talking about more babies. Girl, if you don't sit down, if you don't sit down, stop playing with me. She likes that. She likes how nice the house is decorated. So shout out to you, Earth to Barb. Successful pumping session from pumping milk. Pumping milk can be a challenging and time-consuming task. But Kalia is glad to have made the effort to successfully pump a bottle full of milk. Scar scratch from postpartum pain. No one told Kalia how unbearable the itchiness would be after birth. And birth plan chaos from labor induction. Kalia wishes things had gone very differently, but she supposes she should just be happy. She and Offspring made a home safe. Still, it wasn't what was planned, and that's always disappointing. It's okay, Kalia. It's okay. So, we're going to stay upstairs and we're going to come take a nice bubble bath. We're going to do a bath with soaks and we're going to do a muscle relaxing soak because she definitely needs to relax for sure and while she's doing that we're just gonna watch Zyla sleep okay why not she's so freaking precious look at that mouth so freaking cute her little um glittered heart onesie Ugh. I just love her my little chocolate baby man they make some cute kids that's one thing we cannot take from Kalia and Omari they make some adorable freaking kids okay uh, and I just feel like I love that, you know, they got their girl and their boy. And I'm just so excited that I didn't have to cheat that. Like, the game literally gave her a boy for her first pregnancy and a girl for her second. So, I'm super excited to see what she will have for her third pregnancy, you know. And, yeah. So, she's still in there having her little soak. We're going to change Kalia into her outfit that she's going to be matching with Zyla. When Zyla wakes up, she's just going to be sleeping for a little bit longer. So y'all can't see the vision right now because I really couldn't find the right type of bottoms for Kalia. But this is close enough. But wait until Zyla wakes up because it's really about Zyla's outfit, to be honest. Zyla's outfit is so freaking cute. But Kalia's not that hungry. But I think we should still cook something. So let's cook a little... Mmm. Hold on. We have, a, how do we have so many options? Who was I playing with that didn't have this many options? Are these, this might be gourmet foods. That's probably why. That's probably why. Whoever, I think it was Omari actually we were trying to cook with. He didn't have that many options let's cook let's try salad and appetizers yeah okay I see 
the gourmet skills not up okay 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 let's try i don't even know what i want her to make y'all i'm just everywhere huh um let's do breakfast it's still kind of early enough for breakfast that's how this would have been nice a smoothie bowl okay let's do a smoothie bowl and let's do a mango smoothie bowl okay come on Kalia Lee oh, I guess it would be great if I press play right but yeah my girl still look good I don't care she had a baby less than 24 hours ago so she gonna always and forever look good to me I don't give a fark okay but this kitchen is so freaking nice so cute y'all this is making me like want them to be in the new house bag because it's so freaking nice in here Zala's gonna be sleeping for a little bit longer so we're going to FaceTime Omari just to check in you know like let him know that they're doing good and check in on Amir because she does miss her son y'all don't get it twisted she loved both of her kids she hates being away from Amir but having this dedicated time to just focus solely on Zyla is very important because you know Amir got all of the time he got all the dedicated time because he was the first child and the only child at one point but Zyla she could never be the only child because she already had an older brother so it would never be a point where the focus should just be fully on her without doing this and then after today you know it's always going to be two kids you know can't go back to just one kid so it's nice for Kalia to have this time and then we're gonna be having two babies and any future babies that they have but like I said they don't have any plans to have any more kids right now y'all like they literally want to wait probably until Amir is in school so maybe when he's like four or five like he's only one he'll be two soon but he's still technically one and yeah I'm gonna go use the bathroom sis She's going to go use the bathroom. And I think I might have her paint. Since there was a... I think it was down here. It was an easel down here. And let's have you paint... Ooh, okay. Let's do something inspiring. Let's do a large impressionism painting. What's going on down here? Soreness everywhere from postpartum pain. It might be embarrassing to admit, but Kalia feels sore both above and below. Oh, my baby frequently sneezes. Is she woke? Is she hungry? Okay, we definitely got to feed her some breast milk. Okay, baby. We coming. Mommy coming. You doing okay right now. You just a little bit hungry. Let's go check on her. And then we got to give her her first bath. Yes, we do after we feed her. And she's a calm baby, y'all. So she, you know, she's not really going to fuss unless something is really going on. Even right now, she's a little hungry. And she's still sitting up there with a big smile on her face. So I love that. And my baby is sore. I'm sorry, boo. We're definitely going to feed my baby some milk. Oh, let's put that other bottle in the fridge. And hopefully I don't forget it. We're going to get milk and feed it to my baby boo. Oh, this is just so nice and relaxing. Kalia, we're going to go feed our baby because we don't have to sit here and finish his painting right now. We're going to get the milk out the fridge. We're going to feed Zyla and then we're going to give her a bubble bath. So y'all can see their little matching outfits and also going to take some pictures of her. Y'all, I love this animation. Like she's really warming the bottle up and she's testing it on her wrist. I love it. Okay, so let's go feed our princess, okay? Let's feed her. Y'all, look, it's just like we got a family of four, technically five with Lily, but like. We got a family of four sins, okay? She gonna go feed her little stinker stink, okay? Go feed my baby. And Kalia is just so happy. Like, even with the soreness, even with giving birth early, even with the craziness of it all, 
she is still super happy to be a mama of two and i'm just so glad our babies are here and healthy for the most part kalia is healthy we're definitely gonna um schedule everybody checkups and stuff so everybody can be good and you know who is somebody who, who are you okay go for it that's fine we don't really care but okay this is what i wanted to show y'all so i don't know if y'all ever really paid attention but kalia has like okay mama we gonna talk to you she she found out she had the baby she excited she don't know what to do but kalia has really light brown eyes like like really light and so does zyla like she came up with her mama eyes like girl wait ah this is so cute she love that breast milk huh that's my mama milk yes it is that baby love that milk y'all please i'm sorry if the baby talk is cringy i can't help it okay I can't help it. She's just too freaking cute. And then she gonna burp her. Hold on. Because I love seeing the little bubbles come out when they burp. Look at her. <laughs> y'all already know I have to snap this picture. Please. It would not be me if I didn't snap the picture, y'all. Come on. Come on, y'all. Come on. Look at my little stinker butts. Hello, mamas. Hello, mamas. Hi. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh, her is so cute. Okay. Now, let's go give her a bubble bath after. Please put her back in the crib. Don't put her on the floor. If you're going to take your mom's call, don't put her back on the Don't put her on the floor, please. Lord, Kalia is ready to pump again. Okay, thank you. Put her down there and go ahead and talk to your mom. Oh, look. That's um that's Omari's brother, y'all. He said congratulations on the addition to the family. Period. Thank you. Thank you, bro in law. Thank you. But we're gonna give Zyla a bubble bath, her first bubble bath when we are done pumping. Her mom had to call, of course, and she's like, Mom, we're doing good. I'm gonna send you pictures and stuff later when I take pictures of her. But me and Zyla are doing good. We just really wanted to take the day together. Uh-oh, why my baby crying? Baby girl, are oh, you tired? Okay, I'm sorry. Go night-night. I'm sorry. Go night-night. I done, I done told her. I didn't know she was tired. I feel like she just woke up. Dang, Kalia, you're not going to be able to uh, give her a bubble bath right now. We're going to have to do that later. Zyla, I'm sorry. Go to sleep. Go back to sleep, babes. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Go to sleep. I'm so sorry, y'all. I done interrupted this baby's sleep. But, y'all, this is so realistic because newborns, that's literally all they do, y'all. They eat, they sleep, and they poop. Like, that's all they do. So, even though she literally just woke up, it makes sense. I wasn't going to, but I think I am going to um, have Kalia go want a little jog so yeah we just want to have her go on a jog so let's get her into some workout clothes where you at girl okay let's go into cash really quick oh yeah y'all i dropped these new cloud loading screens i dropped 10 of them go get them please on my patreon right now okay i wasn't sure if i changed her hairstyle but i guess i did in this one did i change them in the rest hold on what is glitch is it her it gotta be her nails it has to be the nails let's see let me see what nails I have on here. I'm probably going too fast. Didn't even see it myself. Uh, girl, where they at? You do. It gotta be the nails that's glitching. Hold on, babes. It's in one of these. Girl, come on. Bracelets. Okay. Let's just look at all the accessories. It's in here somewhere. Somewhere down here. Those freaking nails off. Okay, that's a ring. Oh, that's what it was. Glitching for sure. Okay. So let's put some other nails on you because those are not working. I don't even know if these are gonna be okay. Okay, they're not glitching. Okay. Let's see. Girl, okay, let's give her a new little workout fit. Because geez, let's just do something new for real. Okay, full body. Because I downloaded some new workout outfits. And, you know, we're not rushing into anything, guys. She just, you know, want to slowly, slowly, you know, get into it. We're going to slowly get into it. 
Um, not that. I'm probably gonna go. This is cute. Kalia is just thick. Like Kalia always had like a nice little body on her or whatever, but this is just crazy thick, girl. You are just you're giving me what I wanted to give. You giving what it's supposed to have. Gave, okay, okay. Oh, I really like the purple. I really like that purple. Okay, let's do that. And let me just find the pants. Okay, here we go. And we're just gonna put you on some simple little. But well, let's do it in white. Let's do it in white though. Okay, I'm gonna make your feet a little bit. Oh, I didn't put my cheat on. Freak. I didn't put my cheat on. We probably just gonna do these because, yeah, they don't make your feet look so big. And then, of course, you gotta put socks on y'all for a long time. But don't judge me. I didn't used to put socks on my Sims. Like, if you go back to my older videos, the Sims got shoes on, but they ain't got no socks on. Don't judge me. But okay, I think we cute. I think we good. All right, so let's go ahead and change Kalia into her workout fit. And then we can go ahead and take her on a nice little jog. So let's do that. I think it was the first one. Yeah. And she's going to go on a nice little jog. Um, She had a pleasant phone call with her mom. So I think that's great. You know, and I'm glad that her mom understands why she's doing what she's doing. And she had another successful pumping session. So that's always great. But yes, girl, we about to go take this little jog while baby girl is sleeping. And she's going to be sleeping for a little minute. So that's amazing, okay? So yeah, while we still got a little bit of daylight, we're going to enjoy it. Matter of fact, how much more time they got left in the summer? <sighs> Y'all, this is the last weekend of summer. That's crazy. Wow. So starting on Sunday, tomorrow's the last day of summer. Starting Sunday, it's going to be fall, so, yeah, that's pretty crazy, but, okay. Um, yeah, we're going to have her go on a jog. She's in a pretty good mood, and I love to see it. I love to freaking see it, okay? <laughs> and let's just go out into the world. We lock the door behind us. Extra secure for baby girl, of course. Um, not you texting and jogging, girl. You better watch where you're going. But, yes. Yes, girl. Okay. So, how do y'all feel about our, y'all, like, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bittersweet for me, like I've been saying, because y'all know this is the last season of the Hyatts, and I really love them, like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to stop playing with them, especially because they just welcomed a new baby, so I know I'm still gonna be playing with them, like, off camera and stuff, they'll just be my go-to family, my go-to, like, when I just wanna play, you know? So, I'm definitely going to still be playing with them and keeping up with them. And, of course, I'll be posting, like, pictures on my community tab on Twitter, things like that. So, y'all keep up with me there. Simply why I've literally on all social media platforms. But, um, yeah, I'm still going to be playing with them. But it's bittersweet in more ways than one. Not only with this being the last season and them just having another baby, but also just seeing from the beginning, like, them just graduating high school. Like, that when we started, they were 18 and 19. Now, they're what? I think Kalia, Kalia's almost 22. And Omari's about to be 23. And, you know, like, even though that's not that much time, right? It just seems like so much time has passed. Seeing them as, like, freshly out of high school, still teens, to now being married in their own home with two kids. And for me, it's just like watching my babies grow up like y'all, like I'm proud, but it's still just like sad to see because they really growing up and becoming like grown freaking adults. Like I just can't. So yeah, yeah, that's why I said it's bittersweet in more ways than one. And also y'all know they've been together since they were 15 and 16. Like right, girl, you change it to the outfit, but we're going to actually go take a quick little shower and we're going to come upstairs just in case Zyla wakes up so we're gonna take a shower upstairs but um let's take a steamy shower but yeah y'all just seeing that you know and like I said they've been together they're high school sweethearts y'all know from the very first video of them they've been together since they were 15 and 16 so think about it Kalia's about to be 22 and Amari's about to be 23 they literally been together for freaking 
seven years like that's a long time so just to see how much they progressed in all those years is just crazy to me but here we are Zyla is gonna be waking up soon go ahead use your diaper baby girl which we are going to be putting her we're gonna be giving her a bath for real for real like when she gets up we're putting her in the tub we actually might oh yeah look she's stinky so we definitely gonna put her in the tub Kalia can you change back into your outfit for me please let's change back into our outfit and let's go ahead and wake Zyla up I know Kalia probably gonna have to pump so come wake Zyla up and we're going to give her a bubble bath her first bubble bath and then we're gonna change her into her cute little outfits and yeah y'all like y'all gonna see their matching fits and we're gonna make sure we take pictures of her and let me go ahead and do this cheat so I can get access to build by because I need to get that camera I just thought about it so we can take pictures of Zyla but let's give her her first bubble bath your little stinky butt girl you stink I hate that they change her eye color back but y'all get it baby girl you stink that was quick hold on first bubble bath y'all look at her little outfit y'all didn't really get to see it hold on hold on let's go change her diaper did your hygiene go up yeah that was a quick bath could we all know I didn't even see you scrub nothing but y'all get it now y'all get the outfits now I'm kind of uh, why you put her on the floor change her diaper what's going on okay yeah change her diaper but y'all get it now y'all see the little, like matching yellow top with the little frilly parts and then the black leggings i wish i could have found flower leggings but y'all get it they still matching and that's all that matters y'all get it with her little bow in her hair look at that and she got a little gold bracelet on y'all know kalia and Omari couldn't wait to freaking deck her out of course her ears not pierced yet y'all it's too it's too early but we gonna get them pierced you know when she's a little bit older not she peed on kalia but it's okay it's okay because you are a baby it's okay so we're gonna um put her down here just so we can pump really quick and then i'm gonna go get that camera so we can take some pictures of baby girl so let me see Kalia's feeling a little bit hungry and a little bit sleepy, so we need to go ahead and put Zyla down so we can pump again. And actually, are you hungry, baby girl? She is getting a little bit hungry. Okay, she sees. I might have her go back to sleep really quick, and then I'm going to have Kalia pump. Cause she I, we did wake her up so we could give her a bubble bath and stuff but i'm gonna have kalia pump and then she's gonna come down here and cook some dinner and we're just gonna make look baked fish with lemon it's really simple and it sounds very healthy but yes this has been a nice little bonding day with the baby this time for real i know i've been saying it freaking all episode but this time for real when xyla wakes up we're going to be taking pictures of her because i need to get some pictures for Kalia and Omari's memories and I need to take some pictures from my thumbnail as well so yeah we definitely gonna be doing that but we did wake her up early from her nap just so we could give her a bubble bath and y'all could see her outfits Kalia literally been pumping all day but that's okay it's all worth it for her babies and I love that all the sessions have been successful alright so let's make sure we put those bottles in the fridge as well and Kalia is gonna come down here so she can cook and girl yes like please you did your little jog we might do us a little late night jog when Zyla goes back down because literally like I said she's literally eating sleeping and pooping that's it and it's to be expected so Kalia feels super inspired oh yeah we got to finish our painting we're definitely going to do that before we go as well because they're going to be checking out of the airbnb in the morning like literally in like 12 hours so i definitely want to make sure she finishes her painting and we are going to make sure that we grab all the milk out the fridge before we go 
But yeah, y'all, I'm really loving this. I'm loving this quiet time. Oop. Well, at least we're not breaking our own stuff at home. Just don't tell nobody. Hopefully, we don't get no incidental charges or anything, you know. They love the tax, but yeah. Because after this, y'all, it's going to be a little chaotic. Chasing around a toddler and taking care of an infant and worried about Lily. And y'all remember, Omari has a full-time job and he's gone 12 hours a day, five days a week at least. Sometimes more. Sometimes more. And also... I hope he's taking his time. Oops. I hope he's taking his time to work on Zyla's nursery because she's going to need her own space. Yeah, we could put a crib in their room for now, but like she's going to need her own little space like Amir did when he was born. But hold on, Kalia. Let me see what you're working with, girl. Hold on. Hold on because you put your foot in it. Put your back in it. She put her foot in it, okay? Not the whole fish with the head and everything, though, but okay. Girl, go ahead and eat. I'll grab you a serving. Hopefully, we could take this with us, too. Yeah, oh, yeah. We taking everything out of that fridge before we go. When we get back home, we not really trying to cook. We not really trying to do too much. Because we're going to have two little babies to watch. But Omari is going to take, you know, some time off. Um, he'll probably be off the rest of the weekend. Or maybe, like... You know, he might go back to work like Wednesday or something, you know? They have more than enough money. They're they're fine. Yeah, he that's what he's gonna do. He's gonna take off until Wednesday. And Kalia's loving it. His baby girl's sleeping a little bit longer. I think after she eats, we're gonna go ahead and try to finish our painting. And then we'll wake Zyla up to feed her. And hopefully be able to get some pictures. Because I really, I really want to take some pictures. Like, for real. We've been trying to take pictures all day. And it's almost freaking the next day. It's almost 12 a.m. But we're going to try. Girl, I'll put this in the dishwasher for you. Because you have one thing on your mind. I understand. It's okay. But we're going to try to finish this painting. And I do want her to go on another jog. But it looks like it's going to be really nice. She's almost done, and we definitely got to wake up Zyla. So after she finishes her painting, let's um, grab us a bottle out of the fridge. Yes, because we on it. Look at all that milk we done pumped. Period. She loves painting. Chef's kitchen. Natural light. Like, everything is just positive. Fantastic food. Look at that. That food was amazing. I feel full and satisfied. She's feeling happy. She's a cheerful sim. How fresh from the upgraded fridge. Okay, girl. The only thing is she's still disappointed about her birth playing chaos, but it's okay. And she still want more babies, but I'm going to need her to chill out on that, okay? And she's a little tired. Ooh. We're going to put this in our inventory because we're taking that with us too. Okay, get the milk for baby Zyla. Oh, she woke up on her own. That's perfect. We ain't got to wake her up. But we're definitely going to get a picture of you this time, baby girl. Go ahead and use the bathroom. And mama's coming with the milk. Where you at, baby? Mommy's coming. So I think we might just have Kalia jog in the morning just because she is a little bit tired. But after she finishes feeding Zyla, we're going to actually bring her down here. So, yeah, let's do that. Because I want to get some pictures of her before we, like, go to bed and stuff. So, yeah. Yes, they're matching. I love it. Stop playing with me, y'all. When I saw the outfit for Zyla, because I picked her outfit first, I was like, I have to find something for Kalia. And I was going to try to find a dress, like, with the same type of print as Zyla's leggings. But I didn't have the best of luck. So, um, yeah. We just went with the matching yellow shirt and black leggings combination and it still you know it still did what it had to do oh she got a pump okay put Zyla down there hurry up girl put her down and then pump really quick and I'm gonna take these pictures while you pump because I can't I'm gonna pose Zyla and I'm gonna take these pictures while you are pumping because i just cannot all right y'all so now we're gonna pose our baby girl 
and I know I have some infant poses in here somewhere where they could just pose by themselves and I think it's somewhere up here I think so it's in here somewhere we gonna find it hold on need snuggle me organic objects do we really need it let's see if we really need it okay we gonna have her do the pose come on girl okay oh we kind of need it okay hold on do we really need it because i can make something work okay so we're gonna click on this full control camera but so we're gonna make this work listen i know i didn't just do all this for it to not work okay oh look at her look at our precious little baby oh my gosh okay 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 I get emotional, please. Okay. Um. Oh, I should have took. Hold on, cause with this mod, you could take like bigger photos. Like you can do like small, medium, or large prints. So we're definitely gonna take it in all sizes because who knows? Who knows who wants the picture? Who knows what we're gonna wind up doing with these pictures? So come on, let's see the next pose. What oh, is so cute? Oh, it's like her sleeping. But I want to see somewhere her eyes open, to be honest, you know? Not the foot in the mouth. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let's take this photo. Oh, she moved, but it's okay. It's okay. She Is it okay? I don't think it's okay. Because I can't rotate this the way I want it to be rotated. Park. Okay, hold on. Dang it, but hold on. I think I can rotate Zyla. Hold on. Wait a second. Okay, this is why I needed that. But let's just, I think I have other poses. I have other poses. I have other infant poses. I know I do. Because this one where I don't need any, like, additional objects or you know anything to go along with the pose i have one where it's just the baby posing and that's what i need right now um, um not that one it's in here i'm probably gonna like speed this up or just cut this out the video all together because yeah but i'm gonna find it because i know i have it and i hope i'm not passing it this one is it this one we're gonna do all of them do we have eight we're gonna do all of them we're gonna do all of them okay let me well, let me see if she goes into it Wait, wait, because I think this one will be good to take a picture with. Hold on. No, it's the way that she's angled. I'm not going to be able to get to her. So we're just going to stop that post pack and hopefully this one. Hold on. I'm going to have to rotate her. All right, I'm going to try to rotate Zyla a little bit. Whew, this is a mess, boy. I hope I am cutting this out the video because I don't want to bore y'all for real. I rotated her the wrong way. Okay, let's see. So, rotate. We're gonna do negative 60. No, we're gonna do 65. That should rotate her back. Okay, now when she does these poses, she should be perfect. So let's get her back into those poses that I just found. Hopefully, it doesn't take me forever in a day to find them again. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, here they go. Perfect. Yay. Okay, and Kalia, I don't want you to fall asleep. So how about this? Go use the bathroom. And I'm going to cheat that up just a little bit so you don't fall asleep. I just want to get these photos. And then, girl, I don't care what you do after that. Yeah, I know she's a newborn, so we're going to act like we are holding her up, okay? 
We're going to act like that we're holding Zyla up. Because I want these pictures. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. Because where do we go? Y'all, uh, please. Oh my gosh. Look at my baby. Look at my little toodle muffin. Hi, the cutest babe. Hi. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Because I'm getting a little too excited. Oops, okay. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. I'm getting a little too excited. I'm getting a little too excited. Let me get some screenshots for me, myself, and I. Hern is the cutest little baby bag. Yes, Hern is. Okay. All right, we got to see the next pose. Matter of fact, Kalia, here, come take some, uh, you could take a power nap or two. I just don't want her to go all the way to bed, you know? Take, like, three power naps. Take, like, three power naps, and then, um, we're going to go ahead and move you on to the next pose, baby girl. Oh, it's so cute. But wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Some of these poses she just ain't gonna be doing yet, you know? Okay, that's cute. Sucking on the thumb is cute, okay? My goodness. Hi, mama. You are the cutest bug ever. Did you know that? Did that baby know that she's the cutest bug ever? I don't think you knew that baby bug. Okay. All right. Ugh. Y'all, she is so freaking adorable. Um, I'm gonna try to take this photo. Hold on, with my G shade. Take photo. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. So it can still be like blurry in the background. Oh no! I wait. Wait a second. Oh my gosh. Y'all, I am obsessed. Like, I am obsessed. Like, y'all, there's no way I'm going to be able to just leave this family alone. Like, I'm going to have to play with them. I'm sorry, y'all. I know my G-Shade looks crazy. This is literally just for, like, pictures and thumbnails. Y'all, I can't. I just can't. I just can't. I just freaking cannot, and I will not, and I won't. Oh, my gosh. She is the most precious, the most perfect little baby. Like, I'm so happy for them. I'm so happy for them expanding their family. It's just beautiful. It's just really beautiful. And they just make the cutest kids, and I just don't know what to do, what to say, how to think, how to act, who to be, okay? Um... Hello, my stinker bug. Hi. Hello, Zyla. You're so cute. I love her name. Let's zoom in and get like a picture of her face. Yes. Okay. Period. Period. And then let me fix my G shade because I know it looks crazy. And instead of having Kalia take those naps, I think I am just going to have her go to bed. But we're going to first put Xylet back to bed. I don't even know if she's really that tired. No, she can actually go to bed. So we're going to put Zyla to bed first, of course. Um, so let's first come change her outfit. And I only did outfits for her sleepwear and stuff, y'all. By the time the next episode comes, she'll have outfits in every category. And multiple outfits at that. So don't even worry about that. Um... We can't even put this in our inventory. We're going to have to leave that picture there. But y'all, those pictures are so cute. Oh, my gosh. 
Oh my freaking gosh. So I look like, what is that big thing on the wall? Yes, Kalia, okay. So, um, Kalia is just sleepy, I believe. Yeah, so as soon as we put Zyla down to bed, Kalia is also going to be going to bed. I hope that she doesn't have to pump again beforehand. All oh, the baby blues. Kalia feels a little blue lately now that the baby has come. Okay. We're definitely going to make sure we do whatever we can possible to help her with that. Um, so I'm glad that she just has one day with her because she's definitely going to need all the help she can get. So she's going to need her man and, you know, keep her spirits up. And if she needs help past that, we definitely will make sure she gets it. But we're going to go ahead and lay baby Zyla back in her crib, back to sleep. And we are going to also get ourselves ready for bed. So Kalia is about to go take herself to sleep. And y'all, I'm going to see y'all in the morning, okay? When they are up. Oh, not you match it with your daughter. I didn't even tell her to put that on, y'all, but... Yeah, I'm going to see y'all in the morning when they're up, so I'll see y'all then. All right, y'all, so it's almost 6.30 in the morning. Um, I think I'm going to have Kalia change really quick so she can go on a quick jog before Zyla wakes up. And honestly, she's just going to leave in her... She might just leave in her um either this outfit or she might leave the Airbnb in her sleepwear, to be honest, because... We only packed one pair of clothes, y'all, so yeah. That was our bad. And Zyla's definitely leaving in her sleep fit because we ain't got nothing else for her to put on. So Kalia did pump this morning. Hopefully we have time when we get back because it says we only have four hours left in the vacation. So hopefully we have time when we get back to grab something to eat really quick, even if it's just like another smoothie bowl and feed Zyla. And then we're going to be heading back to the house, but... I think this was a very successful, you know, 24 hours bonding with Zyla. Just that extra needed bond that Kalia needed. And she's obviously ready to get back because she is feeling a little bit blue from having Zyla. And she just really needs to be around, you know, she needs to be around her son, her husband, her family, her friends, all that stuff. So, yeah, we're going to definitely make sure we keep an eye on that. And like I said... If she needs help past that, we definitely will do that. And she loves being active, actually. So that actually falls in line. So that's perfect. Um, we definitely will stay up on that. You know, not push ourselves too much. But just a little bit, you know, just a little bit. Um, I don't want her to be out here for too long. So I think by like 8 o'clock, we're going to head back to the house. We actually might head back now because uh, I know Zyla is going to need to wake up and eat. So, yeah, let's go ahead and head back to the house with my baby. And Kalia, we're going to jog here. And then we're going to make sure that we come wake her up and feed her. And we're probably going to grab ourselves a little smoothie bowl this morning after we feed our baby girl we're gonna grab another smoothie bowl and we're gonna grab a berry smoothie bowl this time and i'm not gonna forget i'm gonna grab this stuff out the fridge because i am good for forgetting but i'm gonna grab that fish dinner that we made and all of our breast milk um so yeah this is good for another nine hours so we'll definitely be home before then to put that in our fridge but yeah, Kalia, let's her can get back because I think when we came here, it was like around 10 o'clock. So yeah, they're definitely going to be leaving soon. The moment she has time to feed baby girl, that's all I'm really worried about. We're not even going to have time to take a shower or nothing. Like, it is what it is, okay? It is what it is at this point. We can take a shower when we get home, you know? We can take us a nice little shower when we get home, but she had a, herself a nice little jog. And, you know, she's a mother first, so she's going to come feed her baby before she even think about eating. Um, wait a second, let's see. Did you wake her up? Okay. Wake that baby up. 
And then we're gonna feed her some breast milk. And then hopefully, like I said, we have some, we're gonna eat, but if not, it is what it is. We can eat when we get home, you know? We got the same stuff at the house. One last feeding in the Airbnb for baby girl. And she like, okay, mommy. Oh, my babies. I love this. I love her and I love them. And I just, I just love love, you know? I just love love. I feel like this is definitely going to be a little bit of a longer episode. So I hope y'all are enjoying that. I wanted to do like a full 24 hours here. So however long that is after I edit, you know, it is what it is. She going to burp her. And yeah, we're going to go downstairs and get our smoothie bowl. Hopefully, Kalia. Because it's about time to go. Oh, and it's over, y'all. So, yeah, we're going to cancel an end vacation. So, I think I'm going to end this part right here. I hope y'all enjoyed. I know I did. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you never miss out when I post. All right, Simmies. I'll see y'all in the next video. You can keep your